Welcome, and thank you for joining us today as we embark on a journey of discovery into the enthralling topic of God's creation. Exploring the harmony between scripture and science. We are going to delve into the profound and timeless narrative of creation as outlined in the Bible and illuminate how it harmoniously coexists with the marvels of scientific exploration. The intersection of faith and science is a subject of great importance and intrigue. It's a realm where profound questions about the origins of our universe, the earth, and life itself converge with matters of spirituality and divine purpose. Today, we aim to explore this intersection, seeking common ground between the sacred texts and the empirical observations of science. As we navigate this fascinating terrain, we invite you to open your minds to the wonder of creation and the ways in which both scripture and science can complement and enrich our understanding of the world around us. Together, we will embark on a journey that celebrates the harmony between faith and reason, reminding us that the pursuit of knowledge and the reverence for the Creator need not be at odds but can instead inspire deeper insights into the divine masterpiece that is our universe. Let's begin our exploration by turning our attention to the Bible specifically to the opening verses of the book of Genesis. In Genesis chapter 1 verses 1 to 2, we encounter these profound words. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Now the earth was formless and empty, darkness was over the surface of the deep, and the Spirit of God was hovering over the waters. These verses serve as the foundation of belief in a Creator a belief that is central to many faith traditions around the world. They encapsulate the concept that at the dawn of time, God initiated the grand symphony of creation, forming the cosmos from formlessness and darkness. Genesis chapter 1 verses 3 to 31 offers a detailed account of the six days of creation, revealing how God brought order and beauty to the chaotic void. Each day, a new aspect of creation emerged, culminating in the creation of humanity in God's own image. Throughout the Bible, we find a consistent emphasis on God's role as the Creator. For instance, consider Psalm chapter 104 verses 24 to 30, which proclaims, How many are your works, Lord? In wisdom you made them all. The earth is full of your creatures. This passage highlights the divine wisdom and creative power woven into the fabric of the natural world. In Isaiah chapter 40 verse 26, we read, Lift up your eyes and look to the heavens. Who created all these? He who brings out the starry host one by one and calls forth each of them by name. Because of his great power and mighty strength, not one of them is missing. These verses underscore the majesty of God's creative prowess, emphasizing that every star in the vast cosmos bears the imprint of the Creator's hand. As we journey through the biblical narrative of creation, we witness the profound significance of God's role as the Creator. It is a role that transcends time and space, inspiring awe and reverence for the divine artistry that surrounds us. Now, Let's delve deeper into the harmonization of the biblical account of creation with various scientific discoveries. One remarkable point of alignment between scripture and science is the fine-tuning of the universe. Scientists have uncovered a multitude of constants and physical laws that must be precisely tuned for the universe to exist as we know it. This remarkable fine-tuning has led many scientists and theologians to ponder the possibility of a creator who designed the cosmos with exquisite precision. For example, the gravitational constant, the speed of light, and the strength of electromagnetism are finely balanced. Even a slight deviation in these constants would result in a universe drastically different from our own. This concept resonates with the idea that God, as the creator, intricately designed the universe to sustain life. Moving beyond the cosmos, scientific discoveries have shed light on the incredible complexity of life on Earth. The field of molecular biology, for instance, has revealed the intricate machinery within cells, where DNA encodes the information necessary for life. The astounding complexity of life at the molecular level raises questions about the likelihood of such systems emerging purely by chance. 
While science provides insights into the mechanisms of life, the Bible, in passages like Psalm chapter 139 verses 13 to 14, celebrates the idea that God knit each of us together in our mother's womb. This biblical perspective emphasizes the intimate involvement of the Creator in the formation of life, complementing our scientific understanding. Moreover, as we explore the vastness of the cosmos and the intricacies of life on earth, we are reminded of the biblical assertion that creation reveals God's glory. Romans chapter 1 verse 20 states, For since the creation of the world God's invisible qualities, His eternal power and divine nature, have been clearly seen, being understood from what has been made. In essence, the Bible invites us to contemplate the majesty of creation as a testament to the divine hand behind it all. Science, in its exploration of the natural world, continues to unveil the awe-inspiring complexity and order inherent in the universe, reinforcing the idea that science and faith can beautifully coexist. This harmonization between scripture and science extends our understanding of the Creator's role in the cosmos and life itself, inviting us to marvel at the intricate design and purpose woven into the fabric of the universe. As we move forward in our exploration of the harmony between the biblical account of creation and scientific discoveries, let's now delve into the formation of Earth and the remarkable development of life on our planet. Scientific inquiry has yielded profound insights into the formation of Earth. Geologists and astrophysicists have meticulously studied our planet's history and have unraveled the captivating story of its birth. According to scientific consensus, our planet transformed from a molten mass into the diverse and hospitable world we inhabit today. What's truly remarkable is how the Earth's geological history, as elucidated by science, aligns with the biblical concept of God's creative work. The Bible tells us in Genesis chapter 1 verses 9 to 10, And God said, Let the water under the sky be gathered to one place, and let dry ground appear. And it was so. God called the dry ground land, and the gathered waters he called seas. This narrative beautifully corresponds with the geological processes that shaped our planet, from the formation of continents to the emergence of oceans. Furthermore, the development of life on Earth, as understood through the lens of science, is an awe-inspiring journey. At the same time, the biblical account in Genesis acknowledges the uniqueness of God's creative act in forming humanity. While science explains the mechanisms of evolution, it does not address the spiritual aspect of humanity, our moral consciousness, or our relationship with the divine, which the Bible portrays as being created in the image of God. Thus, we find a harmonious narrative emerging where science elucidates the mechanisms of life's development, and scripture highlights the divine intention and purpose behind it all. The earth, with its geological history and the rich tapestry of life it sustains, invites us to contemplate the beauty and intricacy of creation. Whether through the lens of science or the pages of scripture, we are drawn into a profound appreciation for the Creator's wisdom and artistry, evident in every facet of our planet's story. While biblical creation and science do not agree on the time it took for things to develop, the harmony between the earth's formation, the development of life, and the biblical narrative encourages us to explore the wonders of creation with a sense of wonder and reverence, recognizing that the pursuit of knowledge and faith need not be at odds but can complement and enrich one another. One of the most profound and cherished aspects of the biblical account of creation is the concept that humanity was created in the image of God. This idea is central to understanding our place in the world and our relationship with the divine. Genesis chapter 1 verses 26 to 27 states, Then God said, Let us make mankind in our image, in our likeness, so that they may rule over the fish in the sea and the birds in the sky, over the livestock and all the wild animals, and over all the creatures that move along the ground. So God created mankind in his own image, in the image of God he created them. Male and female he created them. This profound declaration speaks to the unique qualities that set humanity apart in the grand tapestry of creation. While science can indeed explain many aspects of our physical existence, it cannot fully address the spiritual dimension inherent in our being. One such unique quality is consciousness. 
humans possess a remarkable level of self-awareness and the ability to contemplate their own existence. This capacity for introspection, self-reflection, and the pursuit of meaning transcends mere biological explanations. It invites us to explore questions about the nature of the soul and our connection to the divine. Additionally, morality is a fundamental aspect of human existence. We have an innate sense of right and wrong, and we make ethical choices that have far-reaching consequences. While science can study the origins of moral behavior from an evolutionary perspective, it cannot fully elucidate the source of our moral compass, which is intricately tied to our spiritual nature. Creativity is another hallmark of humanity. We are endowed with the ability to imagine, innovate, and create art, music, literature, and technology. Our capacity to bring forth new ideas and expressions reflects a divine spark within us, transcending the boundaries of the material world. It's important to note that while science and philosophy can provide valuable insights into various aspects of our humanity, they do not offer a complete picture of our spiritual nature and the profound depth of our connection to the Creator. This spiritual dimension remains a deeply personal and transcendent aspect of our existence, and it finds its fullest expression in our quest for meaning, purpose, and our relationship with the divine. In summary, the biblical concept of humanity being created in the image of God invites us to embrace our unique qualities, such as consciousness, morality, and creativity, as reflections of our divine origin. While science can provide valuable insights into the physical and biological aspects of humanity, it is through our exploration of the spiritual dimension that we come to a fuller understanding of our place in the grand narrative of creation. In bringing our exploration of God's creation, exploring the harmony between scripture and science, to a close, we find ourselves at the intersection of faith and reason, where the biblical account of creation harmoniously converges with scientific discoveries. Through our journey, we have uncovered profound insights that remind us that belief in a creator and the exploration of the natural world can not only coexist but enrich and deepen our understanding of the universe. In closing, we stand at the intersection of faith and science, recognizing that they are not antagonistic forces but complementary facets of our quest for knowledge and understanding. The harmony between the biblical account of creation and scientific discoveries invites us to embrace a holistic perspective that celebrates the intricate design and divine purpose woven into the fabric of the universe. Thank you.